Tiffany Haddish looked like a princess as she attended a Disney panel discussion at the Essence Festival of Culture on Sunday in New Orleans. The 42-year-old looked striking in a bright yellow dress with all bullying, sleeves and a high waist. The Grammy winner paired the flowing A-line frock with matching sandals. Her blonde hair was closely cropped and she accented the look with large gold earrings. The multi-talented actress has recently completed production on the Disney film, The Haunted Mansion, which is expected to be released next year. She will co-star in the family-friendly comedy with Rosario Dawson, 43 and Owen Wilson, 53. <music> Tiffany will be on the big screen next month in Easter Sunday, which is based on the life of fellow stand-up comedian Joe Coy. The funny lady has shared that she turned to comedy to help her deal with some of the traumas of her childhood. Her mother suffered from schizophrenia and when Tiffany was 13, she and her four siblings were put into foster care, each being housed in separate places. The family was reunited a couple of years later when her grandmother took in Tiffany and the other kids. At the Variety Changemakers Summit in June, the after-party star said, When I was in foster care, I mean, I thought I was going to die there. I didn't think I would make it to 18. And when I made it to 18, I was like, okay, I got to really think bigger. And I did think bigger, and I'm definitely where I thought I would be. The actress experienced homelessness in her 20s and lived out of her car for a while. Those experiences inspired her to write the book, Layla, The Last Black Unicorn, and to found the She Ready Foundation, which pairs foster children with internships. When I was a kid and I was moving around, all my stuff had to be in trash bags, and moving like that is not good for the self-esteem because it make you feel like garbage that can easily be transported to here or there, you start thinking of yourself as such, as garbage. That was the worst feeling in the world personally, and I told myself, if I ever get any power, I'm going to try to make sure kids don't feel like that. If I can reach out, I'm going to try to change that feeling for them. The unbearable weight of massive talent actress said one of the first things her organization did was to provide foster children with suitcases, 